This is quality content. They are literally watching paint dry. <laughs> Yo, I sing in your room. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. Apple pie. <gasps> We're not baking. <laughs> She's out. <laughs> Welcome back everyone. So it turns out we originally planned the craft and book gift video as one video, but this took so long yeah, and there's so, so much, much stuff. Content. So we're like, we're just gonna do it into two videos instead. So similarly to the last one, we think that giving books and something handmade at Christmas is amazing. So why not combine the two? So we picked out some books and some crafts to go with them. So you can give both to your friends at Christmas. did the baking last night so we I have all the stuff that. here it's more of a decorating craft this is based around the book the rosewood chronicles by connie glenn in that book there is a boarding school and the boarding school has different houses which all have different crests so i made the crests so we are going to be decorating these do you know what house you're in have you taken the house quiz no i have not and i feel like okay. that should happen as we need well. to do that now because then it will tell you which crest you should be decorating do you know which one you are stratus <gasps> cool. or stratus i don't know what like the the right way to pronounce it. I hope it I'm is. conch. That's such a funny name. Your friends will describe your dream crush hat. Okay. Uh, uh, I think. What was your favourite subject? You got it. got it. I got, you got conch. conch. Okay. <laughs> Yay! I'm gonna do the bear. You're gonna do the bear. Okay. So the ones that have like the little divots are the bears. Yay! And then the ones that have like the swoopy bits are the stags. Swoopy. And then these other ones are the. So we made these cookies vegan and we're also going to make vegan icing. So normally when you make icing like this that you can pipe, you would do it with eggs. But turns out on the internet we found out you can do it with chickpea water. We get some action shots. Ooh! Will, our camera guy, gave us the little GoPro to use and we're milking it for this one. Yeah. This is a POV putting this in the... <laughs> Here. So I think this is going to get really messy because it's icing sugar and it always does, but we need four cups of this. So we're going to... Are we supposed to be... <laughs> ready. Are we I told you it's going to get messy. Wow. Three. <laughs> this is a slider shot. <laughs> <laughs> it does smell very much like... Um... Icing. Okay. Maybe not that hard. You're like, <laughs> I'm just like, you're like, like, your hands were ready to take over. You're like, I was like, let me do this. Does it have to have stiff peaks? No, I mean, oh my god. Baking, baking, baking queen. <laughs> um, the one word I know for baking. I'm like, oh, got to use it. Got to use my knowledge. I think I blacked out for a moment. What are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll say it again for the camera and you can just also pay attention, I guess. We need to colour the icing. So my house is yellow, yours is red. So we're going to colour the icing those colours and then pipe. Yes. So let's split between these different bowls. So a good way of putting piping into piping bags so you don't get it all over everywhere, especially if you're only using a little bit, is if you take the piping bag and then you just kind of fold it like this. So you can put the icing straight in there. And then you've just got like a little piping bag. As you can tell, it is going... Great. Great. I think I'm gonna put myself up for a bake-off. This is mine. This is the amazing art piece. So if you're not familiar with the Rosewood Chronicles, they are a book series. There are currently three books in the series. And they're about a girl called Lottie Pumpkin who goes to a boarding school. Don't want to give a lot away, but essentially, mistakenly, people start to think that she is a princess who has come to the school sort of undercover. There is a princess at the school, but it's not Lottie. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. There's no turning back when I do this. There, done. And look at that. Is it running? No, see? Oh, you're adding details? Yeah. Girl, you're killing it. Ta-da. Done. Okay. okay, three, two, one. Oh, that's so good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, it's so soft. Mm -hmm. Do you want some, Will? Really good, softer than I thought. Review by Will. You can make these and give them to your friend along with the book if you can resist them and not eat them immediately yeah. like we did. I just like, oh, here's your present. I, I ate some on the way. <laughs> Thanks. For what? Oh, you're gonna plug. I made Hogwarts out of gingerbread, or at least I tried to. So go enjoy that after A wild this. ride. <laughs> yeah, a wild, crazy, it's a mess. So this 
Witchcraft is for, if you're giving someone a book like Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens Agenda, also known as Love, Simon, which is a film adaptation. So the idea is that this is a little friendship jar, so you can decorate it, and then inside you can put bits of paper that have things like your favourite memories with them, yeah. or like little activities to do together, which is going to be very cute. We were talking earlier about how if you mess this craft up and it looks really ugly, you've just given them an ugly jar and that's really cute. But yeah. I realised, if I do that deliberately to begin with, I can make an ugly Christmas jumper jar. Yeah. So that's my plan. What are you doing? So I know this is going to fail. I just know it. <laughs> but I'm going to do the like little speech bubble Love Simon logo. I would write the name of the person, but since I'm not giving this to anyone, I'm just going to write my name. So like Love It's a self-gift. Yeah. So we have some jars and we've also got some paint. So I guess let's just get started. See what we come up with. Yeah. I couldn't get anything out of there. Okay. Good luck to you, sir. She's a genius. For a while, my tunnel was a DIY tunnel, but all of the DIYs, I would just film from specific angles because they all turned out shit, but I just tried to make it look good. <laughs> and I don't know why great. I kept don't going with it. it Did you do a lot of like art and stuff when you were a kid? Not really. My brother and my mom were much more like, like they are both really good at drawing and I was always just sitting there like with a stick figure. <laughs> just doing thumbprints. Yeah, and they, they were like drawing like detailed characters. I was like that with videos basically. So if you have seen the film Sasha with the book and you are in love with the characters, which you probably will be if you have, mm -hmm. then there is a sequel which is about Simon's friendship group, but it focuses on Leah called Leon the Offbeat, which is all about her being bisexual and her crush on a friend, won't say who, no spoilers. And there is a video on this channel about it actually, about um, bisexual on, representation with Hafsa. So we'll put a link somewhere so you can watch that if you want. Yeah. So if you're waiting for it to dry, while you do that, shall we also get in the little pieces of paper that we're going to do the messages in the jar on? Okay, so what colours do you <gasps> the want? The pink is so beautiful. So you can do, as we said, like memories that you've really enjoyed, things mm -hmm. you want to do together, and then put them in the jar and they can pick them out. I'm making this for myself. So I'm just going to be like, love yourself. Oh, cute. Like little, <laughs> like little affirmations and yeah. stuff. <laughs> love yourself. <gasps> That's gonna be so cute. If this was filled with like pink notes, I think I would just have like. That's really cute. I'm just gonna draw, draw a crown on this one. Queen. Because that's what I wanna hear. <laughs> I think this is gonna be really cute. Do you watch Drag Race? No. <gasps> you don't? Why? Oh no, this, this, it wasn't dry. So now I'm gonna do the daunting task of painting on the letters. I'm gonna actually get up the logo. And then I just decided I was gonna draw a cat on top of my jar because why not? Oh no, it's wet still. Oh no. It's fine. Oh, no. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let's know. not bring the chaos of other crafts yeah. into this beautiful moment. <laughs> Do you have to listen to me, like, just blowing out right now? This is quality content. They are literally watching paint dry. He's <laughs> <laughs> gone. He's out. <laughs> I mean, you're doing those lines pretty straight. It's the only thing I've done straight in my life, am I right? He's a bit cross-eyed, but we don't mind. Okay, <laughs> We love that. Yeah, that's... <laughs> And you ask, what does this have to do with Love, Simon? It's kind of like the emails, basically. Yeah, and also I think Love, Simon has a lot to do with friendship. Like, it's yeah. a lot to his friendship group and how they come together and, like, him worrying about how they're going to react and all this kind of stuff. So I think it's just nice, something that's, like, a little book about friendship and then a little craft for your friends. Do you think his friends were bad friends? I think it's often said, and it is correct, that the book is often better than the film. Yeah. And I think in this case, that is the case, because I think in the book, they were better friends than they were in the film. Yeah, for sure. The ending scene, I mm. feel like it's like much better. Yes, we're being very cryptic, so we don't give anything away. But yeah. if you oh, read yeah, so, the book. Sorry, no spoilers. Cat. He's a cute boy. Did I just make a jar for my cat? <laughs> I think I, I think it's gonna it went from being like, wow, I love friendship to being like, my cat deserves good things. This is a craft all about friendship and Rowan's made a jar for a cat and Baker's made a jar for himself. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Yay, look at our jars. We did it. that. Cat side out. Yeah. We did it. We did that. Boom. 
so these are the things we made or the remains <laughs> the of remains them. The remains of the things that we made. So now we are finally done. All three crafts are complete. So we've got our jars, our friendship jars or cat jars as this one became. The cookies which already got eaten, but luckily we made spares so we can ice them later and give them as yeah. well. And the bath bombs, of course, in the other video. Yeah, absolutely. If you wanted to be real extra, you could make all of these things. Give all oh the books God. together. That will be a pretty cool Just know that it's going to be a long day of crafts. <laughs> just like prepare yourself. <laughs> so if you have any more ideas for like books and crafts, please leave them in the comments for people to get some inspiration for them. As always, subscribe to Platform for more bookish videos and also subscribe to Vagard yes, for more like crafty, Harry Pottery, like cool videos like that. And to check out what's going on with the um, gingerbread Hogwarts. <laughs> I'm not ready. <laughs> What's the name of Malfoy's dad? Lucius. This craft is... Wait. Coffee. <laughs> Sorry. I think I have something in my mouth. Your tongue! Maybe I'll do it, love well. Okay. Oh, well. <laughs> Chance of being... Whose phone was... Oh, it's mine. <laughs> is this in the blue group? Hello.